Shohei Otani just had one of the more anticipated sports press conferences in recent history, and I'm going to be reading off a bunch of the quotes because it was announced earlier today that he would have a statement prepared through a new translator, not his ex-translator Ipe, who he was speaking on. So he was going to have a statement prepared that would hopefully answer all questions and he would not be open to questions. Now, Fabian Ardaya, who covers the Dodgers for The Athletic, was tweeting the quote through this, so I'm going to be reading off his tweets saying what Shohei said. So he opened it up saying he has never bet on baseball or any other sport and never had anyone else place bets on his behalf because there's been a lot of speculation surrounding this. And his quote was, up until a couple days ago, I had no idea this would happen or this was happening. And then he went on and talked about Ipe. He said, Ipe has been stealing money from my account and has told lies and then Shohei said that Ipe never told him reporters had reached out about the bank transfers. He said Ipe told Otani's reps that Otani had paid his debts. And then Otani said all of this has been a complete lie. So this is crazy. He was lying on Otani's behalf to Otani's representatives. Basically, he was saying that Otani paid off his debts. And in reality, Otani didn't know about this. Otani was just an innocent person in the middle of this. And Ipe instead had access to his bank account and was sending money to pay off the illegal bookmaker in Otani's name. And then Shohei Otani said he didn't know anything about this gambling until the team meeting. He said there was some semblance of what he said in the meeting, but he was just as confused as everyone else and basically just heard this story a matter of hours before everyone else did in the public. And he said that Ipe basically told him that he was the one sending the payments from Otani's account. So Ipe Pay could have been admitting to Otani after he was caught that yes, he was having access to Otani's bank accounts and was responsible for sending that four and a half million over to pay off the debts to the illegal bookmaker. And then Otani just said, I am just beyond shocked. He said that he'll let his lawyers handle things from here on out, but he is, quote, completely assisting all investigations. So Otani is fully against Ipe. This is just such a tough scenario. I mean, he said he's completely shocked shocked just based on the fact that they were with each other year round they were basically tied at the hip ever since he came into major league baseball with the angels and now he's just beyond shocked he was lied to by one of his best friends and now he's letting his lawyers handle things and he's assisting them in investigations against Ipe. so basically to sum it up from fabian ardaya he said shohei otani spoke for 12 minutes in a room that included several high-ranking dodgers officials as well as dave Roberts, Kike Hernandez, alleging that Ipe lied to him, the Dodgers, and lawyers about the extent of the payments, and Otani repeatedly said that he didn't bet. So this is just an absolutely crazy scenario. A 12-minute press conference where Otani released a statement through a new translator, and he's basically saying that everything Ipe did was a lie. He was stealing money from his account. He was sending money to pay off his gambling debts from Otani's account. Just a wild situation to start the Major League baseball season.